Hi guys, it is Sunday, April 29th, meaning that we are officially at the final day of our build. We are not going to finish it today though, because the weather sucks, but also we just have a couple of days left. So we are going to use those couple of days to the fullest. Um, so until Wednesday evening, we can still keep working. Uh, but today we planned it to be the last day. Um, as you might have heard throughout the last few vo vlogs in my voice, uh, I haven't been feeling great. Um, I have a cough and a very b bad cold, so um, building hasn't been too fun, but both of us are very tired. Today it is horrible weather, um, meaning that we can't do too much. So today, this morning, we basically postponed everything because it kept starting to rain. Um, we did some small things indoors, but nothing too interesting or too major. Uh, but now we are going to install the four burner stove. So that will be done right now and I think that will really change the kitchen again. And afterwards we will probably install the sink and faucet, so that should look good as well. Um, yeah, not too sure what else we will do today because we wanted to work on the slatted base, but we need this tool that we don't have that's still underway. And um, yeah, we might also re have to reach under that area still and work there, so it might not be the best idea to start working on the slatted base yet. Um, but we will probably do that tomorrow then if the key arrives, that tool that we need. Um, but yeah. So let's take a look at this four burner stove and install it and um, yeah, I'm very excited to see what that turns out in. burner stove so happy with that we originally wanted either a two burner stove or uh, with an oven we couldn't fit an oven oven so we were trying to find a three burner stove that was a little bit smaller than this because three hobs would be perfect would be more than enough but yeah we didn't find one that was smaller than a four burner so why not go for a four, four burner if you can and if it still it has a good size so that's what we went with because the oven couldn't fit. And now it's time to install the sink and faucet, which is Yori's just picking up from the apartment. And yeah, I think um, this stove and the sink, as well as the fridge that we still have to install, all have the same color, so I think this will all blend in very nicely. The faucet does have a, a little bit of a different color, but that's all right, we, we like the shape, so that's why we went for that one. So yeah, it's a short day, but it's a kitchen kind of day, and I like it. We have a sink and a faucet, yay! We're just weighing it down with these two bottles of water to make sure that the adhesive sticks properly. But other than that, this part is finished. We ju just now have to connect the water pump to the faucet and a wastewater um, system here. Now all we have to do is add some sealant around the edges here so that it's all watertight. Because the weather has been so bad today, we only installed the four burner stove and the sink and faucet. But we did end up removing the entire wardrobe on the wall in our apartment. It used to take up this entire space, but we have removed the entire thing and sorted out all of our clothing. Since we will be living in a van, we obviously don't have much space and um, that means that we have to sort out our clothing very well. So we donated quite a lot of it and I'll be bringing something that is still of good quality but that I won't wear. I'll be bringing that to family. So uh, the weather really sucked today and I think it's not going to be great either tomorrow. So we hope that we will be able to do something but we're not too sure yet what we will be doing. Um, we have still got quite a lot of sorting out to do so that might be done if the weather isn't great and if it is we have a lot to do in the van still as well. But we'll see you guys again tomorrow. Have a nice day and goodbye!